Hello, dear Pisces. Today I am ready and prepared for this reading, with advice, revelations, and tarot prophesies for you. I hope you are doing very well. I thank you infinitely for your presence, for your likes, and your beautiful comments. Of course, also for your subscription. It really makes me very happy that you are here. Please stay until the end. If you are here, it may not be by chance. Maybe there is a message that you need to hear right now. Remember that you are the owner of your future, and you are free to make your own decisions. Keep in mind that these messages are general. If they do not resonate with you, let them go. Now let's look at the energies that are developing in different areas of your life, such as love, money, health, and family. First, I leave you with the tip of the day. You will know how to discern in order to see things clearly and choose what suits you best, even if that means closing a negative emotional cycle that you refuse to accept. You may be feeling depressed today without knowing why. There is probably no real reason. Your biorhythms are just a bit low. Today is a good day to treat yourself to a concert, a play, or a movie, or to buy yourself something you have wanted for a long time. Things are going well and they are likely to stay that way. You will feel like adopting a new personal philosophy. Perhaps you have been reading some motivational books lately. You may want to use certain inspirational quotes from them. You need to get a new way of programming your ideas. That way you won't waste time going around in circles with negative emotions. You will enjoy meditating or simply analyzing your existence. Someone close to you may develop some strange symptoms that will cause you to panic. It never hurts to consult a doctor, but when this person does, he or she will likely discover that these problems may be nothing more than stress, overwork, overeating, or overdrinking. So, don't panic either. Chances are, however, that you'll find yourself making phone calls or running errands for this person in an attempt to get him or her to rest. You may need to give immediate attention to a lot of paperwork that has to do with new plans for your work interests. Getting it done right will probably require a lot of inventiveness on your part, but you'll get it done. You're particularly quick, smart and focused today, so you'll be able to finish anything you try to do. In the evening, attend a concert, lecture or other event in your community. Today, if you find yourself caring for others, Find time for yourself as well. While there are times when sacrificing your needs for others is appropriate, doing so all the time will make you feel abandoned and resentful. If your day seems to be one of these, consider making some plans to go out tonight or tomorrow. Keep things balanced. Today is not a day to become the little counselor. If people ask you for advice, feel free to give it. However, if you are not specifically asked, it is best to keep your opinions to yourself. This is a very good day to forget about a current situation that is causing you a lot of stress. Do things that free you up and relax you. Make sure you get plenty of sleep. Below are your lucky numbers and color for today. But first, I invite you to leave me a like. Your support encourages me to continue with my readings hoping to help you in your daily life. Your ruling numbers for today are 4 and 18. Try to use them as much as possible. Take advantage of them since they will only be with you for today. If you have the opportunity to participate with these numbers in a drawer, don't miss the chance to do so. Your lucky color for today is salmon. Try to wear some clothing in this color, or you could use an accessory that contains it as this will bring luck to your day, and it will also make you look incredible. If throughout the day you have to choose something that contains this or another color, do not hesitate to choose the one that contains your lucky color. It is a good time to resolve previous conflicts, to reconcile with people who are very important to you, but who, for some reason, are keeping a great distance from you today. One of the most important things in life is to maintain good relationships with family, friends and even to have good business relationships if you have your own business. 
Of course, all human beings, at some point, need someone else, so it is essential to give up pride and walk alongside those who consider you someone important and vice versa. It is not necessary that you get back in touch with absolutely all the people with whom you have had problems in the past, there are those who are better off far away from you, so do not insist on getting them back into your life. You only have to choose well which are the people you should not remove from your life and send those people a message, make a call, take the initiative to talk again, solve things, promote harmony, love and, if necessary, forgiveness, which is essential in life to continue progressing. The universe is inviting you to pause and reflect on the path you've taken. You've been through challenges, some of which are hard to leave behind, but each experience, good or bad, has been a necessary step towards a better place. Today is a day to recognize that everything you've been through has led you to a moment of clarity. Now the clouds are clearing and you can see more clearly the rainbow that forms after the storm. This is a reminder that every step, even the slowest, has been in the right direction. It's the perfect time to let go of the rush. Don't rush when making decisions. Let things flow and take time to contemplate what you really want in your life. This advice also applies to your emotional life. Even though you may feel like your relationship is on pause right now, this pause is crucial so that you can both reflect and find a stronger path together. Remember that sometimes love needs time to mature and grow stronger, just like a garden that blooms best when cared for with patience. Your relationship has the potential to grow and overcome any obstacles if you both continue to believe in it. The world card tells you that you are closing an important cycle in your life. You have learned valuable lessons and are now ready to begin a new chapter. The world invites you to leave the past behind and look to the future with confidence. It is a reminder that you have the power to create the reality you desire and that the challenges you face are part of the growth process. In terms of health, relax a little more. Don't let yourself be carried away by the overly strong emotions generated by arguments. Avoid dragging on topics that torment you and remember that you are a free being. If you don't try to keep your mind at peace, you will hardly be able to stay physically well. Most headaches or high blood pressure are caused by strong emotions that are not controlled in time. So be careful with that so that the matter is not serious. To keep yourself at peace, it would help you to go to places that transmit inner tranquility or get close to people who can generate that effect on you. There are friends and family members who are like a pill, like a healing. Take advantage of this to reconnect with the ties that do you a deep good. Forgiving always liberates and has surprising effects on the body. In terms of work, keep your concentration as a priority. Don't get distracted, especially when you're working so you don't make bigger mistakes that can later be punished. You need your job, so value it well. Take the time you need for each thing, focus and complete all assignments. If possible, optimize your work so that your tasks are completed in less time than they ask of you. If you're looking for a job, don't pay attention to the comments of people who think they don't have the obligation to seek excellence, that they're not perfectionists, because everything has its reward. Strive for what you think is valid for you, even if you don't see it at the moment. If you take your steps correctly, there are very influential people who are always there and who will make you very tempting offers. Remember that the motivation for which you are dedicating yourself will remind you that you can't allow anything to make you deviate from what is truly vital. Organize your priorities and they will always work perfectly. In terms of finances, Today is a day to look at your finances with a new perspective. Even if you feel somewhat worried about certain financial aspects, it is essential to remember that every financial challenge has a lesson behind it. Someone close to you could be making difficult decisions, such as giving up a joint opportunity to allow you to advance in your career. This sacrifice, although painful, is designed to help you prosper. Don't see it as a loss but rather as an investment in your future. Luck will be on your side if you learn to trust the process. 
Some financial opportunities may not present themselves immediately, but everything you are experiencing is preparing you for something bigger. These days, you are likely to receive recognition or a surprise that will help you feel more secure with your finances. The key is to stay calm and not be carried away by impulses. Carefully evaluate each decision before acting. Today is also a good time to manifest your desires to the universe. Give your attention to what you really want to attract in your financial life. Use positive affirmations and visualize the abundance you desire. This act of manifestation will not only help you maintain a positive attitude, but it will also attract the right energies to you. Remember that abundance is not only measured in monetary terms. Spiritual wealth is the foundation on which everything else is built. Lastly, take care of your energy and avoid spending on unnecessary things. Make a short-term financial plan and stick to it. Luck will smile on you if you act wisely and patiently. Remember that the most important thing is to maintain a balance between what you earn and what you spend, so that abundance will come into your life naturally and constantly. As for love, the struggle to dominate the story you may be living always brings with it some conflict. It is necessary that you and your partner understand that it is not about dominating each other, because it is not good to want to impose yourself. Since you are not in a fight, you are in love. You must communicate better to stay closer together, if that is your case. It is important that we recognize that understanding this will keep everything in peace and harmony. To advance towards the maturity of the relationship, it will help a lot to try not to act impulsively. Mutual respect always bears good fruit, there are times when you have to give in a little, even if it is difficult to do so, so that your partner understands that you really care and that your pride is not above the relationship. If you are single, focus on your own personal projects and do not be sad about the fact that you do not currently have a partner. The right person will come along, but you should not let the lack of focus come into your life. Work on yourself very hard, invest everything you can in growing in all aspects, and whoever has to come, let them do so to complement themselves and not to fill any feeling of emptiness. That is the key. Today, in the family sphere, it is important that you take time to strengthen your ties with your loved ones. Open and honest communication will be key to resolving any misunderstandings or conflicts. Sometimes, an honest conversation is what is needed to clear things up and strengthen relationships. Take time to share with your family and express your gratitude for their support. The atmosphere at home can be a source of comfort and stability, so make an effort to keep it harmonious. Patience and understanding are essential to maintaining peace at home. In terms of energy, your energy is on the rise today. In fact, you will feel like the day is going a little slow, but don't worry because, as the hours go by, you will be getting into very good shape. The planets are with you. Trust them. The positive situation that you have to enhance today is that you are characterized by being a balanced person, you know how to observe things with judgment. This good ability will help you a lot to discover the positive even in adverse situations. Use your magnetism and your charisma to reach those people who are crucial and key tools for your projects, because they will know how to listen to you. On the negative side, be careful because sometimes stubbornness can prevent you from seeing things from another angle. You should learn to listen a little more to the people who approach you to make some kind of suggestion, they may be right, you just have to give them the opportunity to improve. Be careful with imprudences in the workplace, also be careful and don't try to do everything on your own. We always need someone. Although it's good to be independent, not everything can be achieved without help. Let other people help you. It doesn't have to be just anyone, but when someone approaches you with good intentions, give them space to contribute to the projects. As for students, you have goals to accomplish, even if the road is hard, remember that it is temporary. Every time you feel like you are falling, you must get back up with your own momentum and with the help of your loved ones, 
but also of your conscience. Don't give up, you are close to achieving your goal. Keep fighting until you graduate, have your degree and can take the next step in life. As for compatibility, today you have an absolutely fantastic day with these three signs, first of all, with people of the sign of Aries. It is as if together you know how you can help each other, complement each other and feel increasingly united and more aware of the things you have to do. Secondly, with people of the sign of Libra. Today there is absolute expansion, any hobby, taste, opinion or thought that you have to carry out will be done smoothly and without any interruption, which is a blessing. In itself, really. Thirdly, with people of the sign of Virgo. You have a charming, fascinating, joyful, happy and active day in itself. Dear Pisces, this was your reading for today. As always, thank you so much for being here with me. Remember that the purpose of our predictions is to guide you, so that you can make more appropriate and correct decisions based on them. If you like these sessions, click on that like button. You can also subscribe and activate notifications so you don't miss the daily predictions. I hope you have a day full of positive manifestations. A big kiss to everyone.